Okay. Spread is still two and a half. Guys, in today's video, we're going to go over a week one matchup for the NFL that I think is the biggest public upset coming our way. Uh, Browns, Bengals. It's actually in Cleveland. It's the Bengals at the Browns. The spread is currently two and a half. Two and a half. Wow. We can take the Bengals, Joe Burrow and the Bengals, and only have to lay two and a half against the Browns. And guess what? 86% of the money against the spread, ooh, I don't know if you can see that, is on Cincinnati. I mean, almost 8 to 9 out of every 10 people betting on the spread of this game currently, here in late June, are laying the 2.5 points with the Bengals. Uh, I'm on the other side. I love the Browns at home. Do not forget one thing. When you're betting on Week 1 NFL, or week one college football, home field advantage is the real deal. I mean, it is serious. And you know what? That's just a fishy line. All that money on the Bengals, and it's not even past a field goal? Two and a half? You know what? The money line is plus 110, and I'm taking it. Cleveland Browns at home, they will knock off the Bengals. I want your comments below in the comment section. Am I crazy? Are you going to bet on the Bengals? Is this a public fade or are you riding with the public? I don't think the public has a prayer here. I think there's going to be one game. You can look down the slate. It's like, hmm, you got all these games. Which one is going to be the game that, you know, they're talking about at halftime at Sunday Night Football or, or the guys on Fox, Terry, Howie, Michael, Jimmy? You know, they're talking at halftime at the four o'clock game about how the heck did the freaking Browns, you know, beat the Bengals by 13, you know, something crazy. And and the fact that that overwhelming majority of the money is on the Bengals, that is your week one public fade. Um, good underdog pick. I'll take plus money all day. Don't go too hard. It's week one. Don't even use a unit. Maybe half units for the entire week one. Probably a smart thing to do. Let a couple weeks go by. Get in your groove be smart. I know you guys want to jump all over things, and I do too. I want to I want to just cook up the biggest parlay right now, throw 100 bucks on it and make 5 grand out of thin air. Probably not the best move week 1. Got a lot more videos coming guys. We're going to look into all these games. We're going to cook up some parlays. We're going to cook up some teasers. We're going to start cooking up this whole schedule. I'll see you guys in the next video.